Of the 100 trillion individual bacteria that occupy a healthy human body, over 400 different species inhabit our digestive tracts. Most perform essential tasks like digesting food, synthesizing certain vitamins, and forming barriers against disease-causing bacteria. One disease-causing type of bacteria, Clostridium difficile, or C. diff for short, is a growing concern in the healthcare community in the U.S. and around the world. Inactive C. diff can be found inside healthy people without causing infection. However, your risk of developing a C. diff infection, also known as CDI, increases with age, illness, antibiotic treatment, and time spent in hospitals, nursing homes, or other healthcare settings, where multiple cases can lead to outbreaks. In healthcare settings, C. diff spores are extremely difficult to eliminate because they can survive routine environmental cleaning with soap and water, as well as hand sanitation. Inside our own bodies, repeated antibiotic exposure may weaken and kill the good bacteria that protect us. This allows C. diff spores to wake up and release toxins that can harm us. The symptoms of C. diff infection range from mild diarrhea and fever to progressively more serious and potentially life-threatening illnesses. In about 20% of cases, infection goes away two to three days after a course of antibiotic treatment has been completed. If the infection remains, the next line of treatment is approximately 10 days of a different course of antibiotics. For high-risk patients, who are immune compromised or spend time in healthcare settings, the disease can recur and spread to others. In such cases, routine treatments may not be enough. There currently are no approved vaccines or antibiotics available to prevent C. diff infection. The U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention has raised the C. diff threat level to urgent. Every year, more than 500,000 Americans are infected and more than 14,000 die from C. diff infection. Researchers in Canada, Europe, Asia, and the Pacific region are seeing increasing rates of infection and raising similar concerns. New, highly infectious, antibiotic-resistant C. diff bacteria are emerging. Global public health officials believe that the increased incidence and severity of C. diff they're seeing may come from these new and more challenging strains.